Hey kids, Trevor the Great here again. Um, I spent the last couple of days working on this big old realm of battle that I got a while ago, but I never really got around to actually painting it because it, you know, I felt like it would take me a long time to sit down and do it all. But I took an afternoon and actually I got uh, this thing done. Um, well, the basic painting took me an afternoon. All the little details and stuff took me a little bit longer. Um, so, yeah, here it is. I, uh, I was going to flock it, but I couldn't decide on what color to flock it. So, I had, uh, let's see, I have, I was trying to decide between Woodland Scenics and the Gale Force 9, sort of bright green stuff, and I couldn't decide, so, um, I just left it as is. But that's okay, because it looks really cool. Um, it matches all my craters and stuff that I have, like this. It goes really well on there. So, you know, I guess I'll, uh, count my blessings. It's, um, the funny thing was it was painted with craft paint that I had lying around. Um, so, it was pretty easy. Um, but that's really exciting. I got that done. Now I have something to play on that's not a mat on my table. Um, and this table can actually get used for what I built it for. So, yay! Um, I, I got a game plan for it, uh, tomorrow. So, I think I might do a report on that, the inaugural game of my Realm of Battle. Um, and hey, if I, uh, if I feel up to it at some point, maybe I'll flock it if I decide what color I want to do. Um, but right now, it's just sort of this brown for color. But that's pretty cool. Um, yeah, oh, got some other stuff cooking at the moment. Um, I'm working on these knoblars. We got a bunch of the, uh, higher level stuff done. This is one of the characters. Let's go over here. There's a bad light over there. Um, he's, uh, yeah, he's one of the heroes. There's a bunch of heroes. They're level three. Um, and they have this cool lava base on them. Um, which looks really awesome, and I actually think that I really want an army that has that basing right now because it looks really cool. So there's uh, yeah, one guy on a horse and then a bunch of uh, sort of infantry heroes. Oh, as well as these um, these cavalry. I think I did these earlier. Anyway, um, yeah, cavalry. Um, oh, and I got this, uh, oops, a, um, working on a Vindicator for a Space Wolves army, for the, the same army, the same, uh, uh, army as I did the, the Thunder Wolves for earlier. Um, it's in progress right now. Um, just use, it, uh, use some chapter house pieces, uh, some Space Wolf doors and things. Um, and I think, well, last time I checked, when I got them anyway, uh, they aren't, uh, weren't available on the Chapter House website yet, so a little bit of a sneak preview there. Um, I don't know if they are right now, I haven't looked, but that's really cool. Um, basically the main chassis is done right now, I've got to put the gun on and the dozer blade and some extra armor and stuff. Um, but that's, the, the gun is going to be magnetized onto the, uh, the vehicle. So that um, it fits. Yeah, Woo, that's what's work going right now. Elliot's still on vacation. That slacker. Here's his messy desk, all messy up and stuff. Oh, hey, it's his birthday when he gets back. So he's starting a Tomb Kings army. So I bought him some Tomb King stuff. Um, from some uh, Reaper miniatures that work in a Tomb Kings army. Cause I'm a nice guy. Um, anyway, that's what's going on. Wow, this was sort of discombobulated. Anyway, uh, yeah, oh, uh, well, I won't see you. You'll see me. Anyway, I don't know what I'm talking about anymore. Bye, kids.